Good evening, everybody. I'm Steve Shamraz. Welcome to the Now Milwaukee. This past weekend, the U.S. Coast Guard had to rescue multiple people across the Great Lakes. One of those rescues happened near Kenosha. The Now's Brandon Rook has the report from Lake Michigan. This rescue was an Easter weekend miracle, and Jay Garman says he's thankful to still be alive. An afternoon kayak for Jay Garman almost turned tragic. He had to be rescued by the U.S. Coast Guard after his kayak flipped over. Yeah, I was in a bad place. In distress with low water temperatures for about 40 minutes. So that, that was freezing cold. I got some waves hit me in the, uh, the face, took me under a little bit, and then I choked on the, uh, the water, and I was essentially drowning at that point and it caused my lungs to hyperventilate. But luckily people on the beach called police and the U.S. Coast Guard was able to get there as fast as they could. But once you get on Lake Michigan, it's very unpredictable. It can change in a heartbeat. That's why the U.S. Coast Guard is warning people about cold water even when the temperatures are warm. We need you to dress for the water temperature and not the air temperature. Something Garmin says he'll remember for next time his dry suit. It looks kind of stupid, but it keeps you warm and alive. You always want to dress for the water temp and not the air temp. Uh, and I foolishly made that mistake myself. Garmin says he plans to get back in the water later this week, but first he has to get cleared by his wife. From Lake Michigan, I'm Brandon Rook for the Now Milwaukee.